Okay, hello. Hopefully I'm not sweet here. We are in a baby one. Well, not quite testing out, but we are going to be comparing two advent calendars. One I've had since, well, I remember this one being, um, being, um, there when I was, like, kindergarten or, like, first grade type of thing. But on the back here, I showed you a sort of, it says, 1988, somewhere on the back there. Um, right there. And so uh, this is uh, this advent calendar has been around for 30 years. So, we are going to open up this one first, this 30-year-old one, and I'm 31, by the way, not 32, 31, but, yeah, see how colorful this is, I mean, yeah, it's a little yellow, ooh, a little star up above there, cool, um, never noticed that, um, then this floats out. See, look at that. Little angel on this side, too. With my little bunny rabbits and shits. This side, this front side we just saw had lambs. Then this half. Look at that. A whole tire. Manger scene, we're gonna pull it out. See, a whole entire manger scene there. Would that, would the newer ones do this type of thing anymore? I don't think so. Anyways, um, I don't know if you see, but there's no numbers with random little characters on here. And you open them up. You open one up for the day. Like, I think we're going to open up the stove. I'm not sure. Because I haven't really taken a look at the thing yet. But. See the little random animals? Animals that are like smaller than the actual thing itself. That's what we're going to be opening. Ooh. This is actually <laughs> being destroyed, sadly. Um, and of course, I mean, this. This originally had candy in it. It was one of those types where you flapped open the flap and there was this, like, um, um, shot, um, this, um, kind of, like, off-brand Dove, Dove-wrapped. Stuff, but it was actually good candy. But instead, we're gonna be eating one of whatever is in this box. And so. Yes, I was right. The dove. Let's open up our first flap here, which is actually the dove. I was correct. 
Okay, the dove says, I'm opening up the dove. You see that? Oh, white city of Nazareth there or whatever. Bethlehem, Nazareth, wherever Jesus um, ended up. <laughs> uh, no, I think it came from Nazareth, right? Mary and Joseph? I don't know. Anyways. Okay, and then on the flat part, it has a little saying, like, in this case, it's going to be the story of Jesus. Uh, the story of Jesus' birth. Oh, by the way, this is a 24 day calendar, advent calendar, um, so, now we're going to read the app finally, um, gonna go in the city of Nazareth, and then we're going to read the second one tomorrow, which is this little, um, Red Bird to continue on with the story. But again, just do one day at a time and you flap open. So we're gonna see what's in the little box I held up now. Oh yeah, no mind this. <laughs> That's my screen name. Um Oh, these are pumpkin petites for us. These are actually store bought. Okay, that's why. Okay. See, these are made from pumpkin pie stuff. It's just the pumpkin pie ooh, in uh, in um triangle <laughs> form no in square form with just a dash of candied whipped topping. These taste roots. These range from these range from very good and very sweet to very overwatered and ripped. So, we're going to try this one right here. And, oh. I'm very wobbly today. Okay. See? Yes. <laughs> I know I'm not the bottom. Oh, what's up? Um, not giving you a full view of everything before I eat it. My teeth are very sensitive. Okay. We add this one out of the way. Eat one nice lot for that one. Okay. Whoa. Oh, yes. 
That's my video, my UFO. <laughs> All right. Now this one. This one is last year's simple pleasures thing. Oh, they even have the thing on the bottom on the back. That's a little lame. Oh, they suggest for the eyeshadow palette, sweep, sweep the color over your eyelids with an applicator or finger. I should have did this before I went to church. That's why I have my other lip gloss on, but yeah. See how random and just unorganized this is? Five, one, eight, three, eleven. I mean, when I was transferring this from my room to here, I was like, where's 12? And it's all the way up here. In that corner, not down here by 11. <laughs> So, I'm assuming we're just going to punch out the number one tapestry thing here. Yeah. And do our stuff. So, we're going to do that. Since five is already almost punched out, too. But I had this for a year. I've had the Simple Pleasures one for a year. So. Oh, yes! I'll get the chair! The whole... Okay, there we go. I can find the perforation to this. Alright. <sighs> oh, I'm trying, guys. I'm trying. This is her number one tapestry. That's a nice thing. It's a pinky neon pink, orangey pink thing. Nice, but hard to eat off of here. <laughs> Okay, let's hope and pray I can get this easily out of here. me, I would... <sighs> what kind of people are you trying to get out of here? Look at 
have the timer. What is the timer? I have the serious problems here, and I'm I'm usually good at pulling things right out. This is just impossible. It's even odd little wedges, and I can't get that darn thing out. Come on! Oh, hey, if I lay it down, I might be in somewhere. Nothing wrong. All that for this tiny little thing. This to pop out of here. What? Why? Okay. Let's see what's inside of here. I'm assuming this is the lip gloss. Excuse me. Oh, no polish. Excuse me. Lip gloss. Apply to lips as needed to add shine and keep smooth. The ingredients: mineral oil, poly, poly, butin. It is uh, Hexile polymer. Senate had dime dime hone silicate. Micro crystalline wax. Fino no fan yeah fennel oxalate. Belong and fragrance. Mate, titanium dioxide. See, whatever. I'm probably shouldn't read the code there. Red sits. Another code. Red tw 27. Another code. Yellow 10. Another code. We won another code. Mica, another code. Nironoxides, another code after that. Hmm. Wow. That's got a poison. <laughs> Alright. I'm assuming this is lip gloss. We're going to swatch this on my hand, one of these hands. Weird. That's what it looks like out of the packaging. Um, don't try. Yeah. Not as pigmented as <laughs> this, obviously. But yeah, this smells. This smells like. Some flavor <laughs> I should know, but it doesn't. It isn't labeled. It isn't what simple pleasures. It isn't labeled, so I don't know if it's lip gloss or lipstick. Am I supposed to assume this is lip gloss because of the packaging? Or am I supposed to 
Yeah, not labeling. So, what's up, simple pleasures? I hope you are right at this. <laughs> or it is, redid this, at least, because I don't know if this is lip strip or lip gloss. This has got some lip stuff out here. Out on the market now. <laughs> Louder pat and shite this. <laughs> Please tell me. Anyways, that was day number one of our simple pleasures and our there's Marmaduke again and our I don't know what brand this is of an actual real open calendar. Not just. Well, days of Christmas. Wah, 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 wah. I will be incorporating each and every item into Mother in the So, I will try to wear this the next day. So, then. Maybe, I don't know, apply the next day's thing. This one, here. I do love the fact that some blue pleasures actually tried on their design here. I mean, a tapestry? Hell yeah. Who would think of that? Nobody but simple pleasures, maybe. But this packaging, it's ought to be labeled or something. Please, simple pleasures. Thank you. Why am I putting this back in here? Because I have no room in my. Anyways, that's in mean, there. In the back in our number one. Spot. Bye bye. That's all for simple pleasures comparison of advent calendars, twelve days of Christmas for this one and advent calendar for this one. This is falling apart. Okay. Okay, bye bye. Now it's my mom, by the way, that popped out. We're kind of doing our decorations today, so. <laughs> Sorry about that. Okay, bye bye.